yes boys happy friday it's honestly it's a beautiful day so i just thought this weekend it'll be good to do a little weekend in the life i'm gonna call myself a hybrid athlete i go for runs i'm training for my first half marathon and i go to the gym a lot so we started off today with some legs and i'm getting in a power lifting so I started off some squats and wow my legs are dead i'll put it on the screen i got some clips of it You can probably tell I don't power lift. My form's a bit, bit naff. And yeah, uh, not the strongest, but we all start somewhere, boys. So it's just gonna be a documentary as well, documenting my power lifting progress. I'm not gonna become absolutely hench and strong as, cause I'm still training and running, but I just wanna try and be as strong as I can. So yes, we're going into Asda now. I'm gonna get some beef, gonna get some eggs, you know, all the good stuff, good protein. So. I'll see you back at home when we'll be cooking it. I also like to add that I just didn't squat. I did some leg extension, some hamstring curls as well, which, wow, my legs are on fire. And I'll admit it, I'll put my hands up. I don't train legs a lot, but I need to get back into it. I need to get back into it. My legs they play a crucial part running as well. So the stronger they are, the easier it's gonna be running. Right, I'm in the kitchen. I've got the camera tracking me, so watch this. Hey, <laughs> anyway, I feel like I'm in a cooking show here. I feel like cooking with Bloom, but my cooking is not exciting. I've got some, I've got some sweet potatoes here. We're gonna do beef mince eggs and sweet potatoes. You know, a bit boring. I eat, I eat for convenience. Let's call it that convenience. It's not the prettiest. It tastes all right. Right, step one, get about 300 gram, 400 gram of sweet potato. It's probably about two sweet potatoes. Get a knife. Hmm. Right, you get a knife and you chop them in half. Let me just show you. Boom. Anyway, right, they are the weirdest looking sweet potatoes. This one looks like an onion and that just is very long. Anyway, they are sweet potatoes. You just want to half them. We're not a Michelin star restaurant here. While the sweet potatoes are cooking, I'm gonna do some editing actually, because I forgot I'm a YouTuber now. Apologies for the editing if it's a bit weird. Uh, I'm not an editor. And also remember, if you're watching this, down a pint of water right now. Right, they're turned over. Now we've got a frying pan. You know what's about to go down. We're gonna cook some mince. Right, I've decided. So I've got about 300, 400 grams of sweet potato. Gonna go three eggs, going bold, going three eggs and then 250 grams of statements. I'll put the calories and macros on screen. Right, it currently looks like this boy is not very appetizing. But wow, look at the protein in that. And we're just gonna add some more. We're gonna add some eggs later on. Beautiful. If you haven't watched my other video, which I'm actually editing in the time lapse, it's about the benefits of being a hybrid athlete. And I think you're burning so much, so many calories. You can eat a lot more. And honestly, you just feel great. It's so much better than like a normal cook because I would not be eating this amount of food on a cook and I'd be hungry. I've been going to the gym for like, I don't know, five plus years so I like to think I've got good knowledge so yeah listen to me you don't have to listen to me but I'd like to help some people that's the whole point of this channel to be honest is keep me motivated keep everyone else motivated get a little community going set challenges see where it goes. Current update of the pan, the eggs do not look the greatest. I wish I just mixed it in rather than just frying them. Probably should have used some oil. I, th I thought the fat would have been enough from the, from the mince, but clearly not. So I'm gonna try and resurrect this. If not, I'm just gonna scram them. Yes, boys, the air fryer's beeped. I'm gonna take a look. Look at that, that is absolutely beautiful. 
but you just take a glance and this is with nothing on as well just take a glance i love sweet potatoes boys just before i destroy this with tomato sauce just look at that got the eggs got the mince sweet potatoes what more do you want it's beautiful right boys plan is scram this meal edit some video and hopefully finish the video as well i'm gonna try and get it out for sunday let's see boys it is i don't even know what time it is let me check let me check what time it is it's half 10 i've been editing for like two hours jesus wow it it takes forever it's not even done it's a two minute video i'm gonna stick to this youtube grind that is it anyway i'm gonna get myself off to bed morning um I didn't go to sleep in my cat by the way, I've just got a really bad bed head. Um, got some breakfast, I'll go show you. Right, we've got six scrambled eggs, couple of sourdough, beautiful. I have this every morning, usually not the sourdough, it's normal bread just because it's cheaper, but I'm treating myself. Boys, right, I'm excited. Got the Dark Sims pre-workout first, right, I'm going to give it an unboxing. The thing is, the drive to the gym is about 15 minutes and that's when the pre-workout usually hits so like i'm gonna have to do this and dip that just tastes quite nice that was very nice that quite refreshing boys i've just got to the gym right oh my god i've never been so locked in for a drive in my entire life I was, oh i'm itching get me in the gym Oh my god boys, that was such a good back session, Jesus, I was locked in, I was focused, and the best thing, I was itching, honestly, you can't beat that feeling off a pre-workout when you're itching like mad, just wanna, just wanna pull some weight to be honest. About an hour and a half in there, I'm usually only an hour, but oh my god, I was, I was locked in, I was in the zone. You know when you just come out to the gym and you're like, wow, that, that was one of those days boys, so I'm gonna get back, get some yoghurt down us, get some oats, honey, you know. You know the score. Put the ingredients up on screen, but you got a bit of everything. You got protein, you got your fats, and you got your carbs. Unbelievable. It's so easy to make as well. Yes, boys, well, just finished editing, and now I've got myself some bacon and sourdough. Bit of a weird combo at five o'clock in the afternoon, but um, yeah, I'm shattered. Yes boys, it's currently now Sunday, it's half 11 in the morning, I'm just about to get myself in the gym, but I'm just going to explain what happened last night, so I didn't take my camera out, because why would I? Um, went for a nice meal, chicken of course, and then just went for a few drinks, you know, Not re didn't go too bad, so I'm not really feeling it this morning, which is good, but you know, you got to enjoy yourself a little bit, you got to have a few drinks now and again, but it's, I ain't do it in moderation. It's going to stunt performance, but come on, you got to have a drink now and again. Quick recap, lovely chest session, but no run today. I've, I've, it's a good decision. I do not want to injure myself this half marathon. Yes, boys, we are back and we've got an unreal post. Post workout meal, unbelievable. Scrambled eggs, butter, and bagels. Let me show you. Look at that. Unbelievable. Six scrambled eggs, bagels, and butter. I actually started eating butter, not margarine, because I just realised all oh, like, the shit that's in margarine. So we're going to give butter a try. So while eating that, I'm going to. I think I'm gonna edit a TikTok and probably edit more of this vlog to be honest. Then chill out. I did say that I'm not gonna go for a run, but I think I'm gonna go for my easy run instead of my long run and then do my long run tomorrow instead of my easy run. Should be the other way around, you should do your long run and then your recovery, but I feel like I need to get out, but I don't think I'll be able to do a long run. Groin's hurting too much. I need honestly I need a good seat. I'll get one tonight.
Boys, I've just realised I haven't even filmed an outro. So, it's me. It is me from the future. I'm a big softy. Anyway, put Strava on screen and my groin is better now. I think this was about three days ago, so the groin's a lot better. So it's not going to stunt the progress and I've been grafting ever since. If you have liked it, drop a like. Cheers.